Here we go at 195 pounds in green, senior Peter Johnson from Bishop Blanchette. And a junior in white from Wilson of Tacoma, Jake Ferris. This is your 195 pound 3A championship match. We're underway. Johnson in the green. The champion of Region 2, first place. Ferris, third place in Region 3. He's the first to score points here with that takedown. Ferris with a takedown for two points. And we're off the mat, back to the center. A minute and a half to go, first period. Johnson, second place last year at 189 pounds. He was sixth in the state meet at 210 in, in the year 2010, I should say. Also a three-year letterman in football for Bishop Blanchett High School. Jake Ferris in white at Wilson. He participated in the state meet at 189 pounds last year. He, too, is a football player, first-team all-league linebacker for Wilson High School. Johnson scores that point for the escape, so it's 2-1. Ferris. Forty-five seconds to go in the first period. Both wrestlers there entangled. And there is a throw from Ferris, and he has two more to take down. Johnson trying to get to his feet, but Ferris rides him hard. 24 seconds to go in the period. Both arms free now for Johnson. Up to his feet, 13 seconds to go. And Ferris throws him back into the circle. That's going to end the first period. 4-1. Ferris of Wilson High School on top. Ferris defeated Joe Stout of Eastside Catholic by a pin in the first round. He won over Cameron Babcock of Shadow Park in the second round, 7-5. And he won the semifinal today over Jeffrey Luth of Yelm, 7-3. Johnson starts the second period in the low position there. He won by fall over Austin Fuller of Prairie and then defeated Chris Iwaro of Everett, 6-4. And his semifinal win was 8-4 over T.J. Cormier of Enumclaw. Escape for Johnson now. It's 4-2. Thirty seconds gone in the two minutes of the second period. They break free. Johnson, the senior in this pair. Jake Ferris is the junior. Ferris tries for a throw with the headlock, and he does get it. And now he's got a near fall. So he scored two for the takedown, and he's going to get some near fall points. Forty-two seconds to go as he keeps working, trying to get those shoulders pinned to the mat. Jake Ferris of Wilson High School. He's added at least five points. He's working hard. 
Johnson turns the other direction. Johnson doing a good job of keeping that shoulder off the mat. Ferris looks to the official. What, what do I got to do? What do I got to do? Eight seconds to go. And two seconds. No, he didn't get it. But he scored five points. Two for the takedown. Three for the near fall. And he's up nine to two. He was pushing for that fall for about 50 seconds in that last part of that period. And boy, hats off to Peter Johnson for keeping the shoulders off the mat. And you know, a successful record like Johnson, 37 and two of the season. He hasn't been in that position very much all year long. So a 9-2 advantage for Jake Ferris. Now he tries the upper body strength. And they're off the mat. A minute and a half to go. Johnson going to try a throw. Didn't work. Ferris controlling things. But they're both to their feet again. Yeah, Johnson really needs to get some type of takedown that leads to a near fall to score points. Wilson backs up. Under a minute to go, nine to two. A warning, a caution against Ferris for stalling. But he's going to win this match if he keeps on his feet. He's got another throw. He's got another two points. Now he's just going for the pin. He's got near ball points again. There's a reversal, and there could be a pin the other way. Oh, Ferris saved himself. He's way ahead in the match, and the only way he's going to lose if he doesn't get pinned. Johnson was so close. Now we try to go the other way. 18 seconds to go. Ferris just has to keep his shoulders off the mat. It's close. It's so close. 10 seconds, and he wins it. Johnson with the pin when he was way behind. He was behind 14 to 7, and he staked his opponent. That was incredible. I don't even think he believes he got out of that. I know that Jake Ferris doesn't believe it. What a match. <laughs> Can you believe that? He actually had to hug the official. He couldn't believe it. A handshake and a winner at 195 pounds, Peter Johnson. And look at the smile. He was dead in the water. And he turned it around and he won with seven and a half seconds to go. Holy mackerel. Hart at 220. Wait a minute, wait a minute.